Well, Andy, Grand Dog Day again, isn't it? Oh, look, I think uh, anybody who, who's come and seen that game today will, uh, will first and foremost uh, not understand how we haven't won it. I think in terms of pressure and chances and um, opportunities and you know and pressure on, like I say, on the opposition there. Um, certainly, second half is. It's a wonder how we haven't uh, come away with the win. Yeah, you've dropped points in recent weeks. They won't have been. You won't have been happy with those. But as well as you've played today, that must make today's result even harder to stomach. Yeah. Look, I think we. You know, we asked for a reaction off the players. Um, we got that. I think the fans were fantastic as well. Backing the players all right the way till the end, um, which is what we're going to need. You know, obviously for the last two games. But you know, you know, it's a results business. Obviously, we want to win games. But in terms of performance um, and a reaction we got from the players was first class today. And um, on another day, obviously their keeper pulling off saves left, right, and centre hitting the bar, hitting the post. Um, it wasn't to be. Yeah, yet again, not getting the second goal has come back to cost you. Yeah, you know, look, it's not for the want of trying there, second half. Um, you know, we said half time and we said it previously, it's, it's about going to get on the front foot, which we did. Um, obviously, disappointed to concede early in the second half. You know, that knocks you a little bit. Um, but I think, in terms of the overall performance, um, you know, that, that second half was, you know, in terms of getting the balls in the box and, and creating chances, and um, it's as good as what we have done all season, um, obviously, without getting the, the goal and the results, which is, which is what counts. How do you assess the, the playoff picture now, having seen all the results and how the table stands? Uh, funny enough, it's you know it, you're still in there. Everybody seems to be matching each other's results. Um, so you know we got two games left, Leighton Orient away, which is uh, you know a game we can get three points in, and then look that sets up the last game of the season. Um, you know could could be all, all winner takes all. Um, other teams have got are going to drop points. Certainly, because there's going to be ups and downs. Um, we've got to make sure we're in there and remain positive, which we will be going down to Leighton Orient next Saturday. Yeah, we talk about teams below you catching you up. If you can keep file within striking distance, you know essentially it could still be in your hands. Yeah, yeah, and uh, you know there's there's a lot of big games to go. There's teams got to play each other around them. Um, you know, so you know for us it's about making sure next week we get something from that game, like you say, and then take it into that final last game of the season. And I'm sure the fans here will come out and support the the players like they have done all season, um, which is going to be vitally important for us now. You know, and if it if it does take that last game of the season to go and win it. I'd back us all the way. Six points left available. Do you think you need all six to make it? Well, I think all six would obviously uh, put you in a better better position. Um, the way results are going, who knows at the moment? You know, teams quite quickly can can lose two or three games on the bounce. Obviously, we've done that. We've lost the last two, um, but we could go and win the next two. Um, so, but look, we've we've got to aim to get maximum points and then and see where that takes us. Obviously, we've been fired last game of the season. That that could end up being a really really important game now. Five without a win, what gives you hope that you can win the last two? Because from the outside, it seems to be slipping away. Yeah, I think anybody and you know the, the, the fans who are here today will, will certainly see what the players uh, are giving, every, giving themselves and giving the supporters um, a performance there, um, which we you know, necessarily haven't had the last couple of games. So that performance, uh, certainly second half where we've had a right go at them, um, gives everybody that positive um, reaction that we want. And, and going forward, that's got to be the same next Saturday and the Saturday. After. You need a few favours from people this week, don't you, with the, your rivals playing games in hand? Like I said before, pe people are going to drop points, teams are going to drop points. Um, you know, and in the week there's a lot of games now, there's a lot of clubs having to play, you know, Saturday, Tuesday, Thursday, some of them. Um, so there's going to be points dropped. Um, we know we're obviously in a position where we might have to rely on some of the others doing us a favour, but it can't rely on them. You, you know, ultimately we've got to got to get a result next Saturday down at Leighton Orient. Yeah, because you could get lots of favours this week. If you don't get do your part, it doesn't matter. Yeah, certainly. And you know, and you've got to take care of yourselves, that's all you can do. Best of luck. Thank you. Cheers, Andy. Cheers, Andy. Cheers. Thanks, guys. Cheers. Thank you.